The climate and biodiversity crisis is getting worse by the day. Millions of people are already suffering its effects. Catastrophic flooding, mega fires, unprecedented droughts, and the beginning of failed harvests. All over the world, fossil fuel companies are decimating areas of high biodiversity to retrieve oil, gas, and coal. And these same companies do what they please to the communities they break apart in their extraction processes. Thanks to unchallenged systemic racism, these communities tend to be black or indigenous. In countless cases, they have literally got away with murder. The University of Cambridge knows all of this. They have even set up their own climate crisis initiative, Cambridge Zero, which in its own words states that if we are to avert a climate disaster, we must sharply reduce our emissions starting today. We are the last generation who can do something about catastrophic climate change. Yet the university and its colleges still invest about 6.4% of their endowment funds in fossil fuel companies, more than 400 million pounds. It is clear that the university, the university that produced Isaac Newton for heaven's sake, can't pay attention to the science because it's in the thrall of the very industry that is destroying our planet. Over half of UK universities have already divested, including Oxford, yet Cambridge still lags far behind. Cambridge students and staff have demanded full divestment many times over the past five years. And at every stage, senior management either delayed or made excuses. We've exhausted every democratic avenue available to us. It is time for the university and its colleges to listen to their constituent parts and to listen to the city and the world they exist in. We demand on behalf of both town and gone that uh, the University of Cambridge and its 24 non-divested coll colleges divest their endowment funds immediately. If they continue to ignore the needs of the society that they exist to serve, then the only reasonable response is a campaign of non-violent direct action. When those in power refuse to listen to calls for justice issued via the proper channels, then they leave us with no alternative. We cannot and we will not wait any longer. By the end of July 2020, we demand that the University of Cambridge and its colleges announce plans too. Firstly, divest from and make no future investment in the following. All fossil fuel industries, unsustainable biomass, and any other non-renewable fuel production. All companies involved in biodiversity, destruction or degradation. The arms trade, which is one of the dirtiest industries. For example, the US military is the world's biggest polluter. Intensive animal farming, which is synonymous with biodiversity destruction and greenhouse gas emissions. All other ecocidal companies and industries. And then use this opportunity to reinvest ethically in industries that produce zero or very few greenhouse gases and pollutants of any form. Positive impact on biodiversity. Zero tolerance for racism or discrimination of any kind uphold all human rights, avoiding all kinds of exploitation via poverty, slavery or other unethical practices. Uphold all animal rights. Promote sustainable alternatives to industrial farming. Involve themselves in community schemes such as public transport, public housing and healthcare. 